Hey guys, it's just Asia here, and I'm excited to show you something amazing, something you never seen or ever felt before. The the literal effect I'm doing this, uh, I'm not I'm not doing the high school thing, but the literal effect I'm doing this means pure perfection. But please, don't. It's not the microwave. <laughs> it's a great microwave. We just got it, but look look what's inside the microwave. Oh my god. What is this thing? Oh my oh man. It's an auto feed electric pencil sharpener. I've been using this thing for weeks and I'm really excited and I'm ready to now talk about it. But you know I'm just really ready and um I'm just ready to just rock and roll. <laughs> here we go. I'm just start saying I'm just ready, but here we go. All right, guys. So I hope you got. I hope you guys are on the edges of your seats because here, I got the Auto Feed electric pencil sharpener in its full glory, and <clears throat> it's from Office World. And as you can see, I already have some usage on it. Ooh. Okay. So you got to know that's a that's a decent product right there. But as you can see, the color scheme is black and gold. Uh, you know, that's cool, I guess. Anyway, I really love this pencil sharpener since I can literally, I can literally run with just look at look at me go, look at look at this guy go. I can run back and forth with this thing. I can um. I can do a lot with this thing, and I really appreciate it for that. But, um, as you can see, it has six to eight milliliters of stone cold metallic hardness to sharpen your pencils. So, you guys should really just appreciate that because the machine works hard enough. But, <clears throat> what's, you know, a show and tell without actually, you know, showing. So now I'm gonna show you, you know, <laughs> it's self explanatory, but I'm gonna show you how this bad boy can sharpen. And as you can see, you have Fabric Castell pencil, so you know, uh, you can tell I'm, I'm kind of artistic, you know, I don't really like to talk about it, but I love the draw, it's one of my favorite things in the world especially nowadays but as you can see I love to use B and B2 so I'm gonna exert the pencil there we go it's sucking in and it's just pushing out you love to see it don't you see that badass point please focus camera oh shoot ah ah come on ah Anyway, okay. So here is my drawing book. Well, my sketchbook. I have a lot of stuff in here. But I'll, I'll show you my most recent stuff, you know. Because, you know, this is nice, it's nice to share. I like that. There's a lot of meaning to it. But, um, got that. I love, oops. I love, oh my god. I love this. <laughs> I love this sketch. Let's see if I can focus. There we go. It's beautiful. I love this sketch because especially the shoes. Let's see. Oh no. Oh no. There we go. I love the shoes. It's one of my favorite parts. And how diagonal my character is. I like to call him Supper. Same Supper. But, um, as you can see, I just draw a lot. But, um, let's do a quick test, okay? Hold this trumpet. But, <laughs> alright, let me try and draw something quick. Here we go. There goes that bad boy. I love flowers, so let's draw a flower. Yeah, it's not the best thing in the world, but hey, if it's something I can come up quickly within like, you know, a second or two. 
I know it's a lot of stuff going on in uh in the drawing, but geez, it's right here. Well, oh man, <laughs> the flowers right here. There goes the petals. Don't worry, man. I'll hold your hand through this whole experience. It's kind of trippy, but hey. And there we go. <laughs> oh man, but <laughs> that was an experience. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, wait, no, 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 no. I gotta prove to you guys that this pencil, this sharpener is actually good. I'm determined to do it. So I'm gonna hop back into it one more time. So there we go. Okay, I should have done this the first time, but boom, boom. I'm looking at the camera while I'm drawing, so that's kind of helpful. Well, not exactly, but here we go. <laughs> All right. Oh, this is weird. It's weird to draw on the left side, but hey, it's good to learn. But um, I'm drawing my character. I call him Supper. And Supper came at a very, very interesting time in my life when I wasn't really sure who I wanted to be. But hey, if I can give a piece of myself to you and you know, at least explain some things about me. I feel like this has been a really good video. So, yeah. But sometimes I actually draw with like uh, flappy ears and sometimes I draw with really sharp, really angled out ears. But I feel like just draw them like that, draw his ears like that. But. Here we go. At the shirt. You know, actually, I used to draw with a sweater before, but I think to, like, you know, make everything different and di diversify myself, I just decided to draw with a shirt. He doesn't have a mouth, by the way. I thought that was the coolest part about him. He doesn't have a mouth. It's more like his own thing. You know, his mouth is all the way, like, down here, you could say. But it's much more in that way, if you understand what I mean. So, like, you could basically say his nose is right here. Then if you go down, it's his mouth. So, <laughs> that's basically, basically the weird quirk of this character. I love doing the shoes. I love doing the shoes. Especially uh, the socks. There we go. Oh, this, this is so much fun, actually. It's nice to draw for our audience, you know. This is a quick sketch, especially on spot. Oof. But hey, there goes a the drawing. It's, it's a really rough sketch of it, but you know, I hope you guys really enjoy it. But I hope you guys love the video and you guys stay cool during this time. I know it's scary, but all we can really do is just stay positive and try our best to just stay, stay safe. So, you know, you guys have a good day and stay cool. All right, bye.